today's date is April 16th, 2018. Just making a short video on my way to work about uh, 50cc scooters, other scooters, other CC scooters, and uh, what you should buy. Now, depending on the state you're in, most states, 50cc, if they're 50cc scooter and below, you're not required to have license or an insurance. Some states are required to have insurance. Indiana is not one of them. Uh, and I just want to talk about speeds of 50cc. People will ask me, how fast does your scooter go? And a lot of times I reply, it depends on which way the wind is blowing. Like right now, I have a pretty strong headwind with light snow, but it's coming straight from the west, northwest, and I'm going into it, and you can see my speed is maintained just under 30 miles an hour. Now we're going down a slight hill, so it has increased a couple miles an hour here, until I get just above 32. And I'm almost on E, so that means the gas weight is not there so you can feel now you're going up a little incline and it slows you down look now we're doing like 27 miles an hour it slows you down you gotta constantly look in your rearview mirror now we're leveling out a little bit here so a 50 cc scooter will go approximately 35 depending on the weather if, if without zero wind conditions, a 50cc scooter will go anywhere between 33 and 38 miles an hour on the average. Now there are exceptions. You can put different mufflers on them. You can put, you know, different accessories to make it go fast. You can unregulate it. But this is just a stock Zuma 50cc scooter that I'm riding right here. Now, now we're going to change directions. I'll show you the speed on it. So you can see the acceleration. It's slower. Now I used to have a 125 cc, and that requires a motorcycle license in the state of Indiana. So I took my motorcycle check ride on my 125 Zuma, and that was in 2012. I'm not sure why I traded it in, but I traded it in, and this is a 2015 50cc scooter. I'm not sure why I liked it, if I liked it better or what. And you can see the speed I'm doing is still like 30 miles an hour. I got a guy right on my butt, that's what I'm trying to pay attention here before he runs me over. I don't know if you can see that either. He's kind of close. Doing what I can. One hand in it down the white line with wind, with a strong crosswind. So the 125cc scooter is a really good option. If you like the 125, I loved the 125 actually. The speed of it was amazing. It could take off so fast, it was awesome. And with my knee on there, I weigh approximately 200 pounds. With me on a 125cc scooter, it would top out consistently at 60 miles an hour. Where this one tops out consistently at 35 miles an hour. Right now, like I said, we have a strong wind and crosswind, and see how it takes a while to get up there. On the video, I notice it's going a lot faster, but it takes a while to get up there. This road's not bad, you got little hills. Try to get the acceleration down a little hill and try to get up 35 miles an hour. But, oh my goodness, I am on E too. Not be good to run out of gas. So yeah, it just depends on what you want. I bought this 50cc brand new. I actually traded in my 125 Zuma for this 50cc Zuma and it was about an even trade on the money. So that's why I did it. And another reason I did it is because it's got a cup holder. I love the cup holder here. It's got this little thing here that flips out. 
where you can carry grocery bags. And there's plenty of room in the seat, just like the 125. The 125 doesn't, the 2012 model didn't have the cup holder, it didn't have the clip, and it didn't have the uh, back rack. Uh, all of the accessories you can buy online for an additional cost, but the cup holder was the main thing. Like, you don't want to go to a fast food joint and get your drink and have to carry a drink like this while you're riding your scooter and only rely on your front brake. It just isn't cool. Yeah, it's a little snowy and windy today. It says April 16th. I'm hoping this is the last day for uh, the weather to be like this. I really hope so. The high is 38 degrees today. And obviously, precipitation is in the air. Comes a big truck, we're gonna go for it. Hopefully it just goes around me, no pressure. This is the only bad part of getting a CC scooter right here, especially when you have a wind in your face condition. There you go. And then wind in your face condition and the just acceleration on the CC is just not there. And plus you got really sticky conditions out right now. The wind is just blowing pretty strong from the left here, from the west. Cloudy, overcast, gloomy day in Indiana. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, depends on what you want. Depends on how much money you want to spend. Like I said, I really like the 125 just because of the acceleration. It can get you in and out of sticky situations where the 50cc, you're going to have to rely more on defense. You're constantly relying on defense making sure other drivers are aware of you but yeah I prefer I don't know which one I prefer I like the 50cc the gas mileage is better this thing actually like you can see I'm on E right now which isn't good I shouldn't do that but the uh, the gas mileage on this is like 130 miles a gallon where my 125cc, I think it was rated like an 80, 80 something a gallon. You know, you get what you pay for though. I like the 50cc scooter. I really do. It gets me where I need to go. I mainly use it as a work commute vehicle. And all these roads are 35 miles an hour. This one right here is 45 miles an hour. But you never get up to 45 hardly because everybody's always turning right into the businesses. So, I mean, it works fine. Like, in, you can't really see it because it's probably too cloudy. But, like, downtown, you can see the skyline if you look straight north of 135 right here. But you can't see it today. So, I ride this thing all the way downtown. And I've taken all the roads. I've taken US 31, Madison, Bluff, 135. All of them lead downtown. And, uh, yeah, I mean, Fun, cheap transportation. Like I said, I'm mainly riding back and forth to work. I don't know. It just depends on what you want, how much money you want to spend. Blah, blah, blah. In and out, burger. <laughs> 